My name is Scott Trulin. I graduated from the best liberal arts college. At Fuqua, I received an excellent grade in strategy. Damn it! Damn it, where was I? Now, I'm using my superior business skills to help businesses do business. This is Fuqua for you. For my first act, I decided to unveil an opportunity that laid right under Station Nine's nose. Ryan, thanks for having me. Tell me what you think of this. It's a dick. I'm sorry? Scott, I'm looking at a dick. Let me walk you through the, the drawing here. So, we added a diving board through the tip, and then we increased the girth of the pool area right around here to accommodate more residents. And then this is the key part here. We added two jacuzzis down here so that residents can enjoy the pool area year round. This idea is terrible. Why don't I go around door to door to the residents of Station 9 and see what they have to say? Absolutely not. Please, Scott, sit down. You know I'm actually going to have to ask you to leave. And you want me to leave right now? Absolutely. It's a horrible idea. Even the best ideas can fail in the face of institutional ignorance. Next time on Fuqua for you. I mean, what kind of degenerates are going out on a Tuesday night? Fortunately, awesome ideas come to me twice a day. Mr. Mr. Buffalo, can I call you Bill? Uh, no, definitely don't call me Bill. Okay. Well. I did some analysis, some foot traffic analysis of the surrounding area, and I'd really like you to have a look. Just make it fast. Great. So, on the x-axis, we have the days of the week. All right, and on the y-axis, we have the number of drunk people within 150 feet of Heavenly Buffalo. That makes sense. Okay. I understand drunk people. Sure. What really stands out to you? I mean, what kind of degenerates are going out on a Tuesday night? Well, well, they're not so much degenerates as they are the future business leaders of America. Um, and they're actually going out right across the street and getting drunk at the tavern. That's a bar? I thought that place was a strip club. So did we for a while. But uh, that's not the point. The point is, they're getting drunk and they're getting hungry. So this represents a sizable opportunity for your business. And I'd love to walk you through some numbers that would show you the size of this opportunity. All right, let's go for it. Great, great. And then we get the size of this opportunity, which is an NPV of $15.6 million. I don't really know what that means, but $15.6 million sounds like a whole hell of a lot of money. I'd be willing to only take, say, 10%. You can Venmo me directly, and then we can call it a day. That's definitely not happening. So you're not gonna pay me you gotta be out of your mind. That's as crazy as that tie. So what are you what are you gonna do with my idea? I mean, I'm definitely gonna be selling buffalo wings on Tuesday night. So thanks for that, bud.